At Barrier, we see a lot of mistakes when companies submit their applications for Cyber Essential certification. These mistakes can add delays at best or can result in an unsuccessful application at worst. So to help you have a smooth, quick, and successful Cyber Essentials application, I wanna walk you through the big mistakes we see and how to avoid them. Mistake number one, no operating system or application version information. There are a number of questions that ask for application or operating system version numbers. This means more than just the name, but the actual version. So for instance, Windows 10 is the name of the operating system. That's not the version number. There are multiple versions of Windows 10, and some of them are old enough to no longer be compliant with Cyber Essentials. So it's important to add that information. The same goes for browsers and other applications. Just saying a Microsoft Edge, for instance, or Google Chrome for your browsers is not enough. The version information is what the question is asking for. Mistake number two, out of date applications and operating systems. So you've gone through all this work and you've gathered the information on the versions, but you then need to go and make sure that all of those versions are up to date. You need to make sure that you've patched and updated all of these things to make sure that they are compliant and secure and you're using the most up-to-date versions of the applications and operating systems you have in your company. Mistake number three, typos in important details. There are a lot of details that the application asks you to provide, and it can be easy to overlook mistakes. But if you make a mistake or a typo in something that's rather important, it can result in an unsuccessful application. So for instance, if you said that you have installed Windows 1 on your desktops, when you meant to say you installed Windows 10, unfortunately that's gonna result in an unsuccessful application. Windows version one does exist and it is extremely old and non-compliant. So before you submit that application, make sure you've checked all those details and make sure that it accurately reflects your company and your company situation. If you would like to get personalized help with your Cyber Essentials Basic or Cyber Essentials Plus application, please contact us. We'd love to help. Happy certifying.